Baby. <laughs> wow. Do that again. Baby. Phil, I don't think either one of us ever expected that we'd be standing here today, but I'm so happy we are. As I was waiting for HR to take me back for my interview, I met Phil, who would like me to point out that he was wearing a custom Versace suit. <laughs> After the interview, I knew I got the job, but I had no idea I also met my husband that day. No joke, it's, it's been an honor to, to be invited, to be up here speaking, to see uh, Elise make you a better man. Elise is one of my oldest friends, and she's always there when I need a shoulder to cry on, and she's always got pasta for me to eat. He opens the door for adventure every single place that he goes. And that's one of the things that I wanted to call out, because what I realized when I was trying to think of what to say today was that you know, I've had a lot of my funnest experiences with Phil, but I realize that they're actually because of Phil, you know, like he because he really does push the envelope and try to, you know, open doors everywhere he goes. Phil became my very first friend at Nintex. We would see each other at happy hours or when I had to grab something from the marketing closet on the sales floor. And he'd always say, hello, Elise. Over some work events and conferences, we became friends and good friends. And as you all know by now, we came to New Orleans and the sparks began. They're obviously a perfect match. This shared love of hosting and for family and friends is really shown this weekend through having all of you guys here and hosting you all in beautiful New Orleans. so proud of how far we've come, both as people and as a couple. We've learned so much about ourselves, each other, and about partnership and commitment. We are the strongest we've ever been. Through our time together, we've overcome some real challenges, and we've shared the most rewarding moments. Through all this, I've learned one real thing. You are the roots in our family tree. You've held us steady. When, when storms have hit, winds are high, you've kept us firmly planted. So good. Can I kiss you now? Can I kiss you now? Let's kiss you now. Can I hold her hands? Or else we don't practice this. Can you believe this guy? He wants to kiss her now. <laughs> Jeez, we practiced this. What a beautiful day, what a beautiful time. It's a, it's a most incredible party I think I've ever been to, disguised as a wedding. It's, it's awesome. There isn't one person who knows you whose life isn't better by having you in it. It's an honor just to be your friend, but to be the person you love is the most wonderful. You keep us humble and you keep us grounded. You've provided the energy for us to grow and blossom together. 
You are strong. You are God gifted. You are impressive. You're patient. You're loving. You are so naturally beautiful. And you are my girl. I vow to always be there in moments of whether they're hardship or celebration. No matter how hard it is, I promise to never give up on you, on us, on our family. I will always support you and take care of you and do everything possible to make you the happiest and the healthiest. And I can't keep you waiting any longer. No, no, wait. No, no, I get to say it first though. You may kiss your beautiful bride. Ladies and gentlemen, it is an honor to present these two precious people as the newly married couple, Mr. and Mrs. Woo! One of the turning points in our relationship was when we realized that sometimes we had a different memory of things, especially when it came to a disagreement. <laughs> Phil would remember what was said, what words were used, where and when, or as he calls it, factual. <laughs> I would remember how something was said, and more specifically, how it made me feel, or in Phil's words, illogical. And now this brings me to all of you. When it comes to our memory of today, this weekend, and our time with all of you in New Orleans, I know our memory will both be the same, slightly illogical. You've made us as a couple feel so celebrated, loved, and supported. We are so grateful that all of you made the trip to help us celebrate the beginning of our marriage together, and we will cherish these memories forever. Elise cares about people on a level that other people can't even imagine. Every single piece of this wedding, every single piece of this weekend was thoroughly thought through, but her thoughtfulness comes from care, care. She cares so much about people, about details, about how people feel. Raise a toast to both of them, because to me they're very special. To a lifetime of adventure for you, Phil and Elise. I vow to be committed to growing together. I vow to always have your best interests. I vow I will never quit. And it's you and I against the world, baby. I love you. 
Out of all the decisions I've made in my life, choosing you and loving you is the best one. I hope I never forget the way I feel right now in this moment, like my heart might burst and take this feeling with me through our life together. I'm so happy, I'm so excited, and I can't wait to be Mrs. Lonely.